So you might be in this really weird situation where your plugged in headphones on your particular iPhone just aren't working at all. Now this can happen for a lot of different reasons. The number one reason, and the first thing I recommend doing for the most part, is making sure that your particular iPhone headphones are fully plugged into your particular iPhone. So it may sound easy, but what you'd want to do is make your way over to the bottom of your iPhone and go ahead and unplug and replug your particular iPhone into your particular headphones. So go ahead and plug it in just like you normally would right here. And you want to go ahead and, again, if it's not working, unplug it, kind of reverse it, and go the other way. Sometimes you may just have to un, you know, basically unplug it and you know, plug it back in. And sometimes that might end up fixing the problem. Now, if these are headphones that you plug in, sometimes you may have to go ahead and play something through these you know, speakers in order for them to play. So open up your music application, open up YouTube, whatever you can, and try going through and seeing if it's working. Another thing you may have to try doing though, is making your way over to your bottom right. So you wanna swipe down from your control center into the bottom right. And what you wanna do is you wanna go and hold, you can either click on that headphone icon or hold it down and then click on it there. But you can tap to that headphone icon right there. And you wanna click on these headphones. Now, when you do that, there might be an option that will allow you to switch between headphones and speaker. So what you're going to want to do is swap between those two. You can tap onto headphones and you should be able to configure it there. If that's still not working, you may want to try restarting your iPhone. So you can hold down on your particular buttons right here and you can go ahead and basically restart your particular device right there too. And that's another thing you can do. If that's still not working, you may want to try restarting your particular iPhone or you may want to try updating it by going inside of your iPhone update panel here, going into settings, general, software update, and try updating your iPhone. You want to see if that ends up fixing the problem as well. So this is just a few different ways to go and fix the problem. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out. So